So hey guys, welcome back to my channel for tutorials. So guys, today I'll teach you how to create new style of science fiction scene with using eVeranda. See guys, that's my science fiction scene. Guys, it's really easy and basic tutorial. Guys, best tutorial for beginners. And see guys, that's my final render. So now guys, I teach you how I create this type of beautiful composition. So now guys, create new and guys select all and press delete key so first of all guys i'm going to take a plane and plane size increase like 10 all 10 yeah right and now guys i apply tree so go to on add and use spline tree this one yes so now guys i change setting on here so firstly guys click on here load preset and use japanese maple this one Yes, and guys go to on here. That's my leaves and show leaf checks. Guys, see that's my leaf count. I like guys take 25 is good. Enter 25. That's my leaves, right? Okay, so guys now go to on branch splitting this one. Yeah, and guys go to on split base. I like one. Yeah, and leaves. I like. 4 is good. That's my leaves. Yes. Right. See. It's good. Okay. So guys splitting also change. I like 0. Yeah. Much better. See guys. That's my tree. It's really good. And now guys I change this one scale size. So go to on geometry and scale. I like minus 2 is good. And press press enter. Yes. See guys, that's my tree. Okay, so now guys select your tree and little bit down like this. Yeah, and guys next one I use this time cylinder. That's my cylinder. And guys cylinder radius and segments increase like 100. Guys radius increase. Yes, more. Like 3.5 yes and depth I like one is good and guys fill cap use nothing yes right see that's my cylinder okay so next one guys I create thickness so you apply solidifier this one yeah and thickness increase like 0 0.3 is good yes See guys, that's my composition, right? Okay, so now guys, I take camera, camera and camera back. Guys, little bit up and press zero. Guys, set your camera angle like 90, zero and zero. And guys, location change. So that's my, yes. And guys, little bit more like 18 is good, minus 18. And guys, select your tree hierarchy and little bit down like this. Yeah. See guys, that's my tree and cylinder. Okay. So next one, guys, select your cylinder and guys, solidify is good and apply. Yes. Right. Okay. So now, guys, I apply simple material. So click on here. Yes. And select your cylinder and create new. Guys, firstly, apply black material, black, and guys, go to on metallic, like 0 0.3, and roughness, 0 0.3, yes. And next one, guys, I create material for inner part. So, go to on here, edit mode, yes, yeah, select face, yeah, guys, select this one, select only first face, and holding alt key and click, yes. See guys, that's my inner selection, right? Okay, so now guys click on here, add material slot and assign check, yeah. And create new material. So, emission, guys, color, I like orange color, 0.024, as I like one, and strength, 30, yes. So, press zero, yeah, that's my composition. Okay, so now guys, object mode and apply more cylinder so the guys duplicate press ctrl c and v so change size 
scale size change yes and height change like this yeah and guys duplicate yes good right okay so guys next next one okay so guys next one select this plane and select the this one and duplicate so go to on top yeah see guys that's my beautiful composition okay so guys select your camera and little bit back and up yeah good right that's really good okay so guys select the, your leaves select your plain leaves and create new material so guys base color i like pink pink is good yeah and guys that's my root click and take dark gray like this yeah see guys that's my tree right okay so next one guys i apply more trees so i select your tree select and right click select hierarchy and duplicate so go to on here on back side press zero i set your composition yes like this and guys select your actually select this one tree little bit closer yeah closer like this yeah much better right okay so now guys select your cylinder and again duplicate so apply on here press 7 guys align like this yeah press 0 and click on here yes and guys scale size change like this yeah really good okay so now guys select your tree and select this one guys duplicate press ctrl c and v so apply on here press 0 and set your view yes press 0 yeah see guys that's really good and click on here yeah and guys go to render setting and be occlusion check bloom power check and space reflection check yes right okay so next one guys i apply this flow texture this one plain texture guys for texture i use blender kit so click on here that's my blender kit material so guys type science fiction enter see guys i have lots of science fiction materials and you can apply anyone is depend on your work that's my materials right and guys apply anyone like this and drag and drop simple yeah see guys that's my material right okay so guys now you can also change this uv so select and press edit mode and select all and press u u smart uv projection check and click on here yes also guys change scale size so you go to on uv edit and select all and scale size change like this so guys go to on here so click on here yes see guys that's my uv more change like this yeah really good right and layout see guys that's my beautiful science fiction texture right okay so guys same apply on here this one so like this apply yeah and guys edit mode and select all actually top one select this one edit mode and select all and press u and smart uv check yes and guys go to on uv edit select all and scale size increase yeah see guys that's my scale size yeah that's it guys so close right see guys that's my materials so press zero yeah good and now guys i apply some 3d objects on here guys i already create 3d objects so go to on append and guys i have objects so guys that's my pillar 
and collection, collection check and append. Yeah. See guys, that's my 3D objects and scale size change. So go to on here. Guys, more and yes. See guys, that's my 3D model. So guys, go to on world properties and black color. Yes. Okay, so guys, now duplicate this collection. This one, that's my collection. Go to on empty, that's my and select hierarchy. Guys, duplicate, press control C and V. Simple. Guys, you can download this 3D character model and project file from my website. It's free. Yes. And duplicate. Go to on here. Press zero. Guys, side view. Yes. Much better. And duplicate. Select this one. That's my object. Select third one. Yeah, and right click, select hierarchy and duplicate, press control C and V. Yes, and go to on here like this. Yes, see guys, that's a beautiful composition. So guys, click on here, render preview. Yes, that's my render. Okay, so now guys, I apply area light, beautiful area light. So guys, use area light and go to on up like this so closer go to down yes press zero yeah guys go to on light and power i like 5000 enter yes select your area light and color guys i use blue color and as i like one and guys click on here yes see guys that's my light Okay, so guys, now I apply fog effect. Fog, so guys, go to on shading here. So press zero. Guys, go to on here. That's my object to change word. Yes, see guys, that's my background. Okay, so guys, now I use principal volume, this one. And guys, that's my principal volume. Connect to volume like this. And guys, click on here. Yes, see guys, that's my fog. And now guys, I change density, this one, like 0 0.01, enter. Yes, see guys, that's my beautiful lighting and fog effect. Yeah, much better. So go to on layout. Yes, beautiful. Okay, so guys, now I apply more lights on this one tree on background. So guys, click on here and press seven for top view. Yes. And guys, select your area light duplicate. So guys, select your area light two and apply this one tree on top. Yes. And one more time, copy. So apply on here. Yes. Press zero. Yes. And click on here. Yeah. See guys, that's my beautiful composition. That's my beautiful lighting. And next one, guys, I apply. This time, guys, select your light, this one, this one, and little bit off. Select all lights and little bit off, like this. Yes, really good. Okay, so now, guys, select your first one light and duplicate more light. Yes, really good, right? Okay, so now, guys, I apply, lastly, wire effect, cable wire. So, guys, for cable wire, I use free add-on that's my cable geo cable add-on guys you can download this geo cable add-on link in description so select and create geo cable and click see guys that's my geo cable and click yes and click yeah see guys that's my geo cable and guys Click on here. Yeah, that's it. So right click. Yeah. And guys, also change this cable setting. So click on here. Select Geo Cable. And see guys, that's my resolution. Use 5 is good. And max step change like this. Guys, count. You can also change. That's my all 
setting you can also change the seed that's my different different style of seeds right okay so next one direction is good okay so guys now i apply material for this cable so go to on here blender kit and type cable solder enter see guys i like this one that's my wire material so click on here apply on wire okay so guys see wire material is not apply so click on geo cable layer geo cable and material yes and guys drag and drop simple yes and guys now click on here that's my geo cable setting and guys cable material change like this that's my solder yes and lastly apply yeah right see guys that's my cable material it's really good right see okay so guys now press zero that's my final render that's my final composition and so guys click on here final render preview yeah see guys that's my beautiful render that's my beautiful composition and guys same guys i show you my final render see guys that's my final render output and that's my tutorial part so guys now click on here that's my render setting you can increase this render like one to eight is good so guys only tutorial part i show you my only one frame render okay see guys that's my beautiful render beautiful composition okay so guys my final tutorial is finished so if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel thank you